All right, guys. In this video today, we'll be putting a snow plow mount on the mule right there because we got a snow plow because they're calling for some snow at the beginning of February. And we already got the plow right here. It's a plow, but it's coming in three different pieces. You got the main frame that hooks to the, um, the thing we're putting on now and hooks to the blade so we can lift it up. You got the blade, you got, and you got that. So that is all we got. So we're gonna put that skit, that plate on tonight in this episode. And in another episode, we'll get the plow put on, put together, and put on a mule. Stay tuned. All right, guys, so I got the instructions sitting right here. I gotta have the instructions because I ain't never put on a snow plow thing for a mule. And I'm not sure if y'all have, but um, so I gotta read the instructions and make sure I get it all right because I don't want to be out there pushing snow and then the whole thing falls off because that would suck. So we're gonna put this bar that's sitting right here. That's it right there. And we're gonna put it right here in these holes. All right, let me read it. No, excuse me. It's in these holes. Right up here. Yep. Yeah. It's in these holes. So go on and what bolts do we use? I'm gonna show you all the instructions here pretty quick. Hopefully the camera focus in on it. Yeah, that's instructions. And so we need I got the bolts sitting right here. Go ahead and tear into these. Use this knife that I just found sitting right here. Never mind, I'll use this one. That one, no, I'll use this knife. I'm gonna cut it. Just to get a little slip to where I can actually open it. is which I'm gonna need four by five five so number five is this one yes I believe this is let me make sure yep one two this one fit yep does this one fit no I need this one does not fit either. Sorry, guys. This one fit, but I got three of them, but I got four of these, so. Two, three, four. So. what it says, I'm trying to read it, I don't know, alright, sorry guys, I guess you could say I don't know what I'm doing here, but I sort of do, and then I sort of don't, and that one surely doesn't fit it, and that one surely doesn't fit it, okay, 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 I know which one to use now, because those, for those, so, yep, yep, Alright, y'all might think that it's really not that hard, but uh, yeah, it is hard, because I have to figure out which one fits what, because there's two different bolts. Move this right here. I found these. Alright, now this goes on top like this. These bolts come through right here. It comes through right there. I just want to put that nut. There. We're not gonna tighten it down really good right now. We will in a minute, but we just want to get these hand tight on here so that we have them on here. Alright, this one's on. Alright, and those are on. 
So what size is this? Look over here. The wrenches. I'm gonna say it's gonna be a nine, uh, one half. Uh, no, I don't think it is. Oh, it's not a one half, guys. We'll try nine sixteenths. Nine sixteenths fit the, fits this one. We'll find another nine sixteenths that fits this one. Yep. And there's Jason. He does have a YouTube channel. It's Jasmo GT. Go over and check it out. And give him a subscribe. What are you doing, Owen? Getting these bolts in here, tightening them. Why don't you get you a socket, Owen? I tried. I just couldn't find them, the ones that fit. These kinds of no, just a socket wrench. Oh, 9 okay. 9 yeah. All the standards are here and all the metrics are in there. Right. So, just to go. Now, you use the wrench yeah. and the socket. Jason tightening it. There's the car that we're working on. This car in his videos. Yep. Uh, in his videos, when we're at the track, that is what he is driving. Right now, we're putting different lights in the front. So we got we shipped them out so that people can do something to them. And the bumper sitting back there. That just mounts on to the front of the wheel. I didn't know that. Mm -hmm. I thought it went on under. It just goes on the front, and then Those two the, that's yeah. where that's what connects. I think the, the push blade. tube, yeah. the push tube for the blade. Yeah, and then that connects to the blade. All right, so oh, wait a minute, Owen. It's right. It's right, sir. No, it's not right, Owen. It ain't. No, sir. That's not right. No, sir. Not that's not right, Owen. Where's it not right? We gotta we gotta do this on the mule. Oh, it is. Yeah. Oh. Well, we gotta take it apart because we gotta do it on the mule. I didn't know that. Cause it shows on the picture that it's not on the mule. Yeah, that's what it shows right there. Yeah. Thank right you too. No, Man, it talks about drilling. Is it say we got to drill a hole? So you might drill a hole. Right? Yeah, you got to drill a hole into the mule. So. That's what it looks like. Yeah. Like we got to drill a hole. Mm -hmm. All right. So this should get this should get it mounted on there. Yeah. All right. So this thing mounts on to this right here. Alright, let's get in, let me get in the fold. Alright, let me stretch away. Yeah, my instructions, I always need to follow the instructions. Makes yeah. your life a lot easier. <laughs> Alright. 
So this doesn't look like it matters what's side. Yeah. Oh, then this, it goes right there. This goes in here. Where that little dot is right there. That's the plate. Like that. Yep. And then the plate. Steel plate. And here's our bolts. Alright, Owen, we'll you'll need to put the camera down. Yeah, I'm gonna set that on the tripod. Because I'm gonna need a hand. Yeah. Alright. Just reach around here and hold that up. So then it just kind of stays in place. Yeah. You need to hold to it, son. Yeah, I know. You got you can't you gotta hold it like you mean it. Mm -hmm. And your hands anyway. Huh? There ain't no other way I can hold it without a slide. Alright. I got you a bolt. I see a bolt. Right there. Here's a I need the wrench in the saw in there. Did, did I get the wrench? No. Nope. nope. All right. So now we gotta hold this up here. Mm -hmm. All right. Let's get us, let's get us another one. Yeah. Make sure. We wanna try to get like two in it. sure I can get these uh so it says let me show y'all what it looks like under where I was all right so you gotta fit under here all right we gotta drill a hole right. we gotta drill a hole right here in the skid plate to fit the u the u-bolt around this on each side so that it holds on this way, and that's where it holds on. Yeah. And when's this other part supposed to be in for the plow? It says by Saturday. Saturday? Yeah. 
hit my jet Now we gotta get a drill. You bolt those up in there. Then we gotta drill a hole. Loosen this up yeah. so that we can uh, line it up. Four bolts in there. Yeah. Yeah, I want to be able to. I want it to be snug, but you can move it. I want to be able to move it. There we go. We need to be able to move it around so we can line up this. Uh, you bolt the holes in the skid plate. So yeah. Yeah, it's a whole plastic skid plate. Um, yeah, the skid plate is just plastic. That should be easy to drill through. Yeah. All right, now let's look on this side. Is that lined up? How is this side? Yeah, it is right muddy. Because we had some snow and that's why I ain't really been uploading here lately much. We had some snow and then it all melted and we had nice weather about 60 degrees a couple days, most days 50s and then it went down to 30s today and 40s. So while all that snow melted it left um, the ground soggy and wet and I went out and rode this thing and got mud on it. and. Uh, this thing pretty much always stays muddy because of me. I can't stay out the mud. No, now the upgrade we got on it now is a bear claw winch. And um, we ran it through up to right here. We just put the added this thing for the shop doors. And uh, well, we took his speaker and Velcroed it on. So we have some music to listen to. And that's pretty much everything we've done. Now it's the plow. Yeah. Sorry if this video is kind of long. Well, yeah, we ain't never done this before, so we don't. Well, we know what we're doing in a way, but then we don't know what we're doing. So, yeah. Tightening them bolts up. Trying to get. How wide is that snow plow? 60 inches, 5 feet. Uh oh. So the snow plow was 5 feet wide? See, so yeah. get them U bolts in there, tighten them down and we should be good. So 
Yep. Oh, uh, we was riding a mule down at the creek the other night. Me and my sisters were. And um, we get down to the bottom of the creek. And I look over and I see something moving and it was white. It had like a triangle face thing. I, don't know. I look over and it's a daggone possum. Nearly, we nearly ran over it, but then he took off. And um, he was about two, two, three foot from the mule. And um, we went back down there and couldn't find him. Yeah. Mm. Too big? Or? We gotta go get our angle drill. Because oh, yeah. it won't fit them today. Yeah. Alright. She's playing. We gotta get an angle drill. That's. What an angle. an angle drill so we can get get up under there. Get up under there in a, in a tight spot. We're in a tight spot now. Yeah. I'm gonna go through here, so. Alright. Uh, drilling that right there, and we should be good. We gotta do it on each side. Now let's see if we can fit the U-bolt on the ground. The U-bolt went from this direction, didn't it? Yeah, went down from up. Yeah. Then we gotta do it on this side, stick them U-bolts in and we'll be about done. I can't find where the hole is. I'm, I got my finger up in it now. I know. I need you to move there. So I it's can. It's right there. Mm. Now we gotta find the hole. Let's move it to you, Bolton. Is that hole big enough? I thought it was. Mm -hmm. Yeah. It should. Yeah, it's big enough. Alright. Crawl back up from under here. Got mud in my mouth. Now I'm gonna fix my hat. Now the tires that we run when we go to the drag strip are just drag radials right here. We throw them on. Go to drag strip that way we can do burnouts. Can't get it to go up. Yeah. And then we got here's the front of the car sitting right there. So, yeah. Some negotiators. Huh? Some negotiators. Yeah, hammer and a pry bar. Alright, I'm gonna lay it ready. Yeah. I'm gonna lay it ready this way. 
Stepped on that piper. Alright, now quicker look at it. That's what happens when you lay down on your keys. Yeah. To your car. Gotta admit, it scared the crap out of me. <laughs> That's all the money. <laughs> Who's in there? The car horn is just blasted. And it echoes really bad in here, so. It's extra loud. Yeah. Yeah, alright, now them things hook on to the back right there, and then hook on to two slits on the front. Give me a half inch socket up. Okay. And a half inch. Mine will be a 716. Just bring me there. Alright, I'll bring it. Alright, I got it. Yep. Here you go. And, oh, I forgot to mention. And the other upgrade we did is this windshield right here. Got a windshield on it. And that's all we did. So, yeah. Now the things that connect to the plow connect right there. I like to, I like to have a heart attack. <laughs> Sitting there, why, 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 why? Gotta put the parking brake up on the mule so she don't roll away. Sorry, Alex. <laughs> sit there, not even expecting it. Just sitting there, what? <laughs> Mom was probably thinking, what are we doing out here? Alarm's going off. You know, having this skid plate on the front, it'll help the front of the mule. Only thing is, is going through them ditches. Yeah. You might hit this. Yeah. Is that it? Now I just gotta put them four bolts on. This mule has, uh, let's see, 87.2 hours on it. Can't really see it right now. And now, maybe you can somewhat see it, somewhat not, because it ain't the best of focusing up close. So, yeah. Um, I'm going to put these four bolts on here and um, tighten it up, and that'll be it, wouldn't it, Jason? Yep. Yep, and that'll be it. So, yeah, I guess I'll videotape until we finish it and get all four bolts on. So, yeah. Put that Where's the other bolt? It's right there. Why do we have extras? 
Thank we you. have like two extras. Well, you know when you might need one. Well, I know, but can it go somewhere? Uh oh. Uh, -oh. uh what? That hole don't line up. It ain't lined up. Mm, so we gotta take him loose. Yeah, I don't know about the other ones. But we probably ought to loosen these to see if. Thirty minutes. Mm-hmm. Huh? Alright, we're gonna have to that hole right there. We're not lining up. Where's the other the socket? Back the small one, huh? Not lining up that back plate. Oh, right behind. Right there. Not lining up to that back plate. Just seem to be putting on over at the table. Now we just gotta tighten them up, and we'll be good. Alright, so I'm gonna end the video here because all we gotta do is just tighten them up and that's it. So, this will be part one out of a two part um, video. The second part, I'm not gonna say it yet, you just gotta stay tuned for the second part. Well, you probably already know already. But um, the second part, then uh, I'll work. So I hope you enjoyed this video. I'm going to hit that like button, share, and subscribe. And don't forget to go check out. And don't forget to go check out Jasmo GT's channel right now. See ya.